how to change text box position on Shopify. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video I'm going to show you how you can have the text box and also how you can change its position for the Shopify store of it or the uh, basically the product page on it. So the text box is going to be a, a specific widget that will allow you to let the freedom for the customers to uh, customize their product or their let's say merch that you're going to they are going to buy from you basically you are going to give them a choice for having a text box and this text box is going to have some specific personalization into the jewelry as you can see t-shirts and etc so basically you are going to install or need this app installed it is going to be very very unique and also very needed into the pod or print on demand we're going to have it right there as you can see i have already installed the text box so we are going to wait for it and we're going to have the um, uh, app enabled so we are going to uh, have it from scratch this is the case if you do not know how to work with the app and also how to have it right there i'm going to have it as uh, saved normally it is going to be in somewhere in here this is it text box now we are going to have everything set up as you can see it is going to be done now we are going to add the display and which is display position so this is going to be the second thing which is going to be allowing us to add the display position and change it so this is going to be the text box and it is going to be in here so we are going to have it saved and it is going to be right there so this is it now how we can change the position of it it is going to be very easy we're going to have the text box in here click on the six vertical dots and put it where we want for example i'm going to have it um aside or not aside but above the quantity selector so we are going to have on the quantity selector just like that we're going to have it in here boom and it is going to be right there so i'm going to click on save we're going to take a look into our um, website real quick so we are going to open up here the website i'm going to hide the spur have the product page and normally it is going to be above so basically it is going to be having a place in here after some few refreshes and also resets and it is going to be taking a little bit of time to set up everything in order so i have already installed it from here it will take a little bit of time so to set up the product now uh, when you have finished that you can go ahead and click on go to dashboard and then you're going to set up the field and have for example a simple text box or product options so we are going to have only a text box just like that here uh, custom for example you're going to have a single line heading just like that and we're going to click on save this is the preview so we have created that field normally it is going to be right there so we are going to refresh the page and it is going to be connected and ready to be written on so here we have it that is it so you can go ahead and change the position of it again by just drag and dropping it just like that that was pretty much it for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and i hope to see you soon on the next one